Hey, what's up? It's your boy, 24-7 here with 24-7 Fusion Media. And holy shit, I would have never thought in a million years. Luke Skywalker series in development at Disney Plus. Exclusive. While most fans weren't happy with the sequel trilogy, Luke Skywalker especially, yeah, I know I was one of them. Disney Plus' Star Wars content has been well received. With loads of new shows coming to the service, Lucasfilm president Kathleen Kennedy promises that there is a story for everyone in a galaxy far, far away. You know, Kathleen Kennedy promised a whole lot of shit to, to everyone. And she, she fell short of everything that came out of her mouth. That's why I'm worried about this. But we'll see. Luke Skywalker series. Luke. Wow. Fandom Wire can exclusively reveal that Lucasfilm and Disney Plus are in the early stages of developing a Luke Skywalker series set around the time era of The Mandalorian. Having been kept a secret in The Mandalorian's second season finale, Mark Hamill surprised fans with the de-aged look of the character. No word on who is set to direct or produce but as we said, this project is in early development. See, that's the thing. Um, with Mark Hamill being de-aged, the person that actually played him was Max Lloyd-Jones with, you know, that technology that had him, you know, that gave him Luke's face. So... That wasn't that wasn't Mark Hamill. It was his face digitally implanted on somebody else, but that really wasn't him. So I wonder how they're gonna do this. Hmm. Probably give us more of the same of what we got in the Mandalorian season two uh, finale, right? So it says here for all these reports, it's important to stress that in development means. Teams connected to Lucasfilm are prepping and writing the following projects. It's not guaranteed they will all make it to air. Sebastian Stan as Luke Skywalker. Hmm. I can see it. I can see it. The only thing that Sebastian Stan would have to do is get Luke's mannerisms. You know, the way he talks, the way he expresses, you know, the way he... um. The way Luke has that fire in him. I'm not sure if Sebastian Stan has that. Or if he can duplicate that. But I know for sure he can't come in there like he's the Winter Soldier. <laughs> but what it says here is. There are talks being held on if Mark Hamill should return with the de-aging technology. But right now the studio is leaning towards a recast. Due to the expensive and current imperfections of the technology. Falcon and the Winter Soldier star Sebastian Stan is one name being considered for the role of the iconic Jedi. You know, I think Sebastian Stan looks pretty fucking close to as as anybody that I've seen that's an actor in TV in the last fucking 30 years. Sebastian Stan is the closest thing that I've seen to Mark Hamill as far as in looks and likeness. So, if Sebastian Stan is, is really... Uh, you know, if he's really good as, as, at what he can do, then he can actually pick up on how Luke Skywalker acts. And, he, and if, he can, if he can implement that and pull it off, then, and of course, with the blessing of Mark Hamill, I would definitely watch Sebastian Stan. We'll see what happens as things develop. Other shows that are coming to Disney Plus is the limited Obi-Wan Kenobi series. The High Republic show, The Acolyte, The Rogue One prequel show, Andor, and two Mandalorian spinoffs, Ahsoka and Rangers of the New Republic. Hmm. Yeah, Ahsoka. That's another, uh, that's another character that people are just waiting to see what happens with that whole Veil of the Force thing. Yeah, people are, um, People are wondering how all this is going to come about. You know, are we going to see Ezra pop up? 
as we're saying, Ezra Badger, are we going to see Ezra show up in the Ahsoka show? You know, people are just waiting to see what's going to happen with that. And another thing, too, is the book of Boba Fett is what a lot of folks are itching and waiting to see what all that's going to turn into. Because I love Boba Fett also. <laughs> Not as much as I love Luke Skywalker, but Boba Fett, he has his place with me. So I'd be interested in seeing that. Um, so y'all let me know, are you interested in seeing a Luke Skywalker show? Are you ready for the book of Boba? What about uh, the Ahsoka show? Uh, I, just, I really want to hear if anybody's waiting for this uh, Andor show. Cause I heard nobody wants that one. So y'all let me know in the comment section below. Please share, like, and subscribe if you haven't already. It's your boy, 24-7 with 24-7 Fusion Media, and I'm out. Peace.